welcome back to our channel and if you are new welcome my name is Jovi and today I'm going to do my um, daily makeup um, disclaimer lang I am not um, a makeup artist I'm just a normal person who loves makeup and you know who loves painting my own face so that's what I'm doing today um, yes yeah, so let's get started <laughs> So guys, as you can see, my face has got lots of like, um, I don't know how you call it, melasma or some freckles. So I didn't have them before Paris. They just suddenly appeared um, when I was pregnant. So, and now it's just so hard to get rid of them. See, as you can see, all that. But anyways, it's fine. You know, it's not number one. It's not world number one problem. Good. That's a primer, and then the next step we're gonna use the. I'm gonna use the foundation, the liquid foundation. This is from Makeup Forever, and this is the Ultra HD. So make sure you shake, shake, shake well before you put it on your face. So I'm just gonna put. A little bit. Oop, I think I put too much. Anyways, I'm gonna use my um, this brush. I don't know how you call this brush. Paddle brush, I think. So, guys, as you can see, I've got marks. Here on the side of my nose, they're from my glasses because my glasses is a bit, um, how do you call it, oversized, so it's a bit heavy for me. I probably have to get a new one, so it leaves that marks there. So at the moment, I'm actually wearing just clear contacts. It's not full coverage guys, just light to medium coverage which I like, I prefer because sometimes, uh, you know, I don't like um, You know, it feels like my face is so heavy every time I've got a full coverage foundation so You know, I'm just go going out, you know, just a normal day so this is fine. See guys, it 
doesn't fully cover my imperfections there. So, for sh of course, let's see, you have to put some on our neck. So we don't look like flashlights, guys. You know what I mean? When I say flashlights, like this is the handle and this is the light. This is too bright, too light, too white. Um, so this is my concealer, guys. It's from Napoleon. Napoleon. I don't know how to pronounce that, guys. But it's a. Um, it's an Australian brand. Australian brand. one we're gonna do some baking and this one is from Ben Nye there you go so I don't do any baking guys the only baking that I do is my face <laughs> We will leave that for a little bit and what I'm going to do now, I'm just going to put this ointment, so it's popo, it's papaya ointment guys, so I'll just put that on my lips, so later on when we apply lipstick, it's not dry and it's not cracking, okay. maybe while waiting for that we're going to do our eyebrows, so a bit of background about my eyebrows guys I think five years ago oh no four years ago I've done like the micro blading so the feathering for your brows and that's what it was because you know year I don't know 2000 guys I think in the Philippines it's very um, rampant it's very known you know like you over pluck your brows because the thinner it is the better and now, you know, obviously it's the other way around now. They do, you know, the thicker the better. And have a look mine. So I overplugged mine before and they didn't grow up anymore. So as you can see guys, I've got no hair under there. <laughs> so um yeah, I've done I've done it four years ago and now they turned like as you can see it's like reddish brownish colour. So, you know, and also the shape is not there anymore, so I still, you know, pencil them in. This is what I'm using. This is from, I believe this is from Face, Face Shop. And this is the designing, designing eyebrow pencil. There you go. And this is what it looks like. There's a spoolie on the other end, and this the pencil.
So this is very critical guys. <laughs> so that's why every time I do my makeup I tell Mike, my partner, do not talk to me or anyone. Don't talk to me while I'm doing my And this one thing that I learned that about eyebrows, they are sisters, they're not twins. So, you know, don't stress yourself too much. But, you know, for me, as much as possible, I want it to look very similar, you know, because Kila is life, guys, we all know that. And it obviously just change the look of your face. The, sh the I don't know, it's just, it just plays a major role. Okay, so we'll just leave it like that for now, guys. Powder. So the powder that I use is from Fanny Serrano from, yeah, I got it when I went home to the Philippines earlier this year. I, it just, yeah, I like this one because it is very, um, the coverage is really good. And um, yeah, I think I can compare it to MAC. I actually prefer to use this one than my MAC. asked me to try it just for seven days because they know that I'm having issues with my um, this um, melasma and um, it helped a little bit actually I've been using it for months now and so I think I can do the vocalize <laughs> So that's our base now guys for all the colors that we're going to use. So I've done with my foundation, my foundation. So probably just do, let's shape our um, brows guys with a concealer. So I'm using that um, concealer that I used before. So it doesn't look so strong guys, it just looks a bit natural even though it's not natural, we all know that. Guys, so for contouring, I use the Bahama Mama from um, The Balm Cosmetics. I love it. I'm so in love with this one guys. So apparently contouring is to make your face look slimmer. So let's do that.
my sister. We applied for my sister's visa. Um, well, she's here for three months now, but we wanted to extend her visa to um, up to 12 months. So that's what I'm doing. We've sent the application already last weekend and they requested from my sister to do the medical. So I'm going to take my sister in there to do her medical. And hopefully guys there's no issues there and you know she can stay here longer because I love having her here. She's amazing guys. At the moment while I'm filming this she's looking after Paris. That's why I love her. And of course Kasi guys, pinanganak akong pango. So, we'll do some contouring as well because apparently this helps your nose to look like it's, you know, matama. So. This is the brush that I'm using, guys. I don't know what it's from. Zueva. gonna do the blush so the blush that I'm using guys is already it's broken it's from Mac I don't know the color maybe this one I'm gonna use dolly mix that's what it says so I'm going to use that and I'm using this brush I wash it already guys I've been using it since forever, that's why it looks like that. And this is what I use from Mecca Max, it's some um, Australian brand to brush, I uh, use, wash my brushes. Power tool. It really works, it's really good. like I'm now a human being mm, okay so guys with the lashes I don't need to do them because I've done my lash extensions a few weeks ago and um, yeah still have some left there so I'm just gonna keep it like that pink na ng anak ko guys mistisa mistisa na ako mas mistisa pa ako tingnan sa anak ko guys Just blend the harsh edges. Char. So, guys, as you can see, you can still see that melasma under there, but I'm not worried about it really. Right. So after that, I'm just gonna do my. Highlights. So this is the highlights that I'm using. This is from also from Mecca it's a shop here in Australia I don't know if they have shops overseas maybe not so I'm just gonna put a little bit on my nose so you know and some on my ear I don't know how you call it cheekbone that's the one so I don't know if you can see it 
can see it properly. Maybe I'm just gonna run through the other one. Give me a second. I'm just gonna use this is my contour kit which is so dirty now guys because I haven't been using them. Um seriously after having Paris I I don't know I already I, I gave up you know putting makeup on my face and um and then I realized like seriously why not again you know do it again putting makeup on my face makes me feel good you know because it's very relaxing for me every time you know putting I put makeup on my face so this is what I'm going to use it's a fan brush I'm just gonna use this one here and Guys, na ano talaga ako kay Michelle Fox, guys. Na adik ko pa sa kanya. Matatawa talaga ako pag nag ano ako nagwatch ako ng movies, uh, movies, videos niya, guys. He, oh, actually I forgot. I'm gonna put this brow cara. They say brow cara because it's it's a brow mascara from face shop as well from the face shop. I'm just gonna use it on my eyebrows. So, it looks like your eyebrows thicker. So the next one would be mascara. So the mascara that I use is from Heroin Makeup. Uh, Heroin Make. Seriously, guys, why can't I pronounce? Yan. I'm just gonna use it on my lower lashes. Oh, guys, hindi ako makita. Hang on. Tada! Hmm, ayan na. Kasi wala talaga akong lashes sa baba, guys. Eh, mahirap. Ayan. I don't know if you can see it, but anyways. And then I'm just gonna do my lipstick. So the lipstick that I'll be using today is from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And um, this is in shade buff. Guys, I don't know. My camera is not getting it guys she's not cooperating at the moment I'm, I'm just using my iPhone um, 7 plus in um, doing this guys so hopefully I'll get my other camera fix the proper camera okay so since we put that ointment before guys so as you can see our lips is not too dry now it's moist mm, moist Young friend, go guys. He always teases me. Um, every time we see each other, he always he's gay. He's so 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 gay. And um, yeah, he always teases me like, oh, how much per unit? Because he thinks that I put like dermal fillers on my um, and lips, but no, everything is natural. I was born with this beautiful big lips. Parang brats lang guys. Seriously, when I was in the Philippines, guys, when I was younger, everyone keeps teasing me. It's like, oh, you know, you got big eyes, you got big lips. And then I came to Australia and voila, everyone big, everyone loves big lips here, you know, bigger eyes. So, guys. So, I'm going to ask you guys. So, yung mga nagtitisa kasi sa Philippines noon na ano, makapal yung labi ko, huyo kayo ngayon, di ba? <laughs> Take that off. Ooh, 
would you have ever done? So it lasts longer, guys. That's what they said. Okay, so my face obviously looks really white, but I think it's just the bright lights making it more, you know, more white. So that's what it looks to now, guys. And um, I'm not an eyeshadow person, so I don't really use eyeshadows even though I do have you know eyeshadows in my collection I don't I don't use it 